What's up, you guys? Welcome back to our channel. Today, we are trying Filipino snacks. So, we went to a local Filipino market and we got a bag full of snacks. Yes. So back for a lot of goodies in here when we did our first uh, trying uh, Filipino food um, a lot of y'all were you know very engaging and you suggest we should try more Filipino food so this is a follow-up to that yeah and plus we haven't tried a lot of Filipino snacks so we thought we would try some in yeah. the video so so let's get to it should we start with savory or sweet sweet okay so let's start with this can you pronounce it Pan de ube. Pan de ube. I think that's. Yeah, it's ube bread. I've heard a lot of Filipinos eat pan de sal. I don't know what that necessarily means. Pan de mean bread. Oh. I think it's tough. like uh, kind of like influence from the Spanish. We should just share one, right? Yep. So it's like a uh, milk bun. Milk? Or uh, like milk, like a bun filled with um, ube. So it's a purple yam cream. Focus on the bread. It is now. There you go. Yep. Cheers. Mmm. It's like Hawaiian bread. Mm-hmm. So good. Mm-hmm. So if you're Filipino, what do you usually like eat this with? Like have tea, coffee. Is it eaten for breakfast or like a snack? Mm -hmm. Look at the purple yam, you guys. 10 yeah. out of 10. Yeah. So 10 out of 10? Mm -hmm. It's likely sweet. It's like creamy. Uh, it's buttery. It's not overly sweet. And I like the yammy texture of the ube. Mm -hmm. mm, so good. While we're on the ube, Pillow, oishi pillows, ube fuel crackers. So they look kind of like cereal. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Cheers. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Wow. This tastes like uh, cocoa puff. Like the crunch outside. Yeah, it's like cereal. And then inside it has like the ube. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looked like that, you guys. So good. 10 out of 10. Man, so far, Filipino snacks is like cracking. Yes, this is good. Okay, next. Next, are we going with savory? I guess we don't really have anything else that's sweet, right? We do. Okay, so we do have another sweet one. What is this called? It's called Ensamada. E N S A Y M A D A. Ensamada. Ensamada. That's what the cashew told us. Yeah. And this one's coconut. Yep. So it's like a bun with a coconut filling inside. With cream and cheese on top. Yeah, with cheese. Alright, thank you. So if you can see it, there's some cheese, there's a white cream, and there's oh a gosh, bun. You're gonna Messy. All right, should I take the first bite? Yeah, yeah. Whoa, big chunks of mm. coconut. Is it good? Mm hmm. It's interesting because the interesting. cheese. Interesting. The cheese is like a little bit salty, but it's so good. The coconut. It just makes it taste like cream cheese. Mmm. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like a the cream is a white sweet cream. The cheese is a little bit salty. Look and at it, this coconut. Have you ever seen a whole focus, coconut chunk? Focus. I don't know. It's gonna yes, focus. Focus. Is it? But it's like that. It's like a coconut chunk. Yeah, inside looks like that. You can see the whole coconut chunk. Like usually, if it's like like the Chinese bread or something, it's they usually like shred. shredded coconut. You know. Mm, I like that. 
Same for me, Sayo. <laughs> Want another bite? I do. It's actually so good. It's like, once I take another bite, I want to take another bite. Mm -hmm. Oh, and Samara, you guys. This is so good. Filipino snacks are not disappointing so far. <laughs> nope. This is pretty good. Okay, on to the next one. Okay. This was not my choice. We decided to get it. Yep. This and is called Mango Nectar. Are you sure you're supposed to drink it just as is? Like, is it just a beverage? Yeah, it's a, just a be beverage. Yeah. Chill, shake, and serve. Yeah. You did not chill that. Why well, didn't chew it? Should we? Okay, I can try it. No. Oh, I mean, we know that Filipino, like, I mean, in the Philippines, it's known for like mango. Mmm, it's good. Is it? Yeah, if you chew it, it's super refreshing. Oh, surprisingly, it's not that sweet, actually. Mm hmm. Mm. Mango nectar, you guys. It's pretty good. If it was like colder over ice, it probably would have been better. Mm hmm. I would give it an 8 out of 10. Yep, 8 out of 10, because it needs something to. Brian, it up. If it's for me, I'll put some vodka in it. I'll chew it. <laughs> All right. Now, moving on to savory. Which one? Should we try this? Mm -hmm. All right. This is called Boy Bawang Kornik. So, Bawang is actually Indonesian too, which means... Bawang means onion. Mm -hmm. I wonder well, if that means the same thing. What does Bawang mean in Tagalog? Yeah. Tagalo? What does Bawang mean in Tagalog? But this is a uh, lechon manok flavor. So uh, lechon, we know it's the pork, right? Roasted mm -hmm. pork. But here it has a chicken. <laughs> chicken thighs. But anyway, this is a uh, fried corn fritters. Not corn fritters. Just fried corn, corn, corn snack. Please don't explode on me. Ready? Ooh. Mm-hmm. Mm, it's so good. Mm-hmm. It's, it's kind of like, have you had corn nuts? Mm hmm It's kind of like that. Yeah. But mm. you know how corn nuts are like, kind of like really hard? Mm-hmm. This is a softer corn nut, but still, very savory. Mm -hmm. I mean, very uh, you know, crispy. This is so addicting. Mhm. Mm These are like one of these addicting like. I like it. This ten out of ten. Dang, we're so good with our snacks right now. Mm -hmm. Nine. I would give it a nine, just because I'm not so sure about the flavor. Yeah, you can tell if it's pork or chicken. Yeah. All I know is it's salty. Right? <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's read the ingredients. Actually, it says chicken flavor. Or oh, maybe manok is chicken. Lechon, manok. Maybe lechon is roast, huh? Oh, yeah. Roast lechon. chicken flavor. Yeah, yeah lechon, manok. Roast it. chicken flavor. We could probably Google it. Let me Google it really quick. Yeah, roast chicken. Yep. We got it wrong. So the lechon part means roast, not. Pig. I like it. We're gonna keep all of these snacks for later. Mm -hmm. Okay, next. Chippy. Oh, chippy. Jack and Chew from the brand. Flavored chili and cheese corn chips. So, if you guys are from the Philippines or you're Filipino, are there any specific snacks that we should try next time? Mm-hmm. We'll try to find it. And are these, the ones that we're trying, are they legit Filipino snacks? Yeah, are these authentic Filipino snacks? Would you find this in, in, in Philippines? I don't like that. It doesn't taste like anything. It tastes like Frito. There's no spicy, there's no cheesy. Yeah. Four the, out of ten for me. Mm -hmm. The flavor is like very, very artificial, I feel like. Yeah. 
two out of ten. Wow. Oh my god. All right, last one. It's the special one. <laughs> this was also Kui's choice, not mine. Is this actually a yeah product products of products okay. of the Philippines? Okay. Cow's crispy squid, hot oh. and spicy. Right here, it's a product of the Philippines. Right here. Hopefully it's not like stinky the moment you open it. Oh, your finger. Oh, I smell it. <laughs> I smell it already. Ew. No. Smell like straight up from the ocean. Oh. <laughs> mm, I don't want to try that. No, just close your no Put the thing over your nose. No, you, you try it first. Crispy. Yeah. Like no, you didn't say it's good, so I'm not trying it. <laughs> no, really. It tastes like Vietnamese um, coma, like dry squid. It's not spicy. Mm. It just tastes like squid, a fried up squid. Mm -hmm. I like it. Eight out ten for me. Remind me of Vietnam. Two out of ten. <laughs> I wish it's a little bit more spicy. Yeah. It's not there's like really no flavor. It just tastes like like I said, a fry up squid. Dried up? Fried. Deep fried squid. Oh. Okay. Well, anyways, that is the end of our little snack video because the market is really small, so we actually <laughs> couldn't find like a whole lot of snacks. Yeah, and we it, weren't sure. Mm -hmm. So let us know in the comment down below what snack we specifically should get, and we'll make an effort and get it and try yep. for you guys. Yep. We hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, give this video a thumbs up, comment down below, and make sure to subscribe to this channel for more videos in the future. And don't forget to keep winning, winning at life. life. See you next video. Bye.